What up, Facebook? Just a little nugget today about um, giving you a little update on this corrupted world. I'm speaking on um, illnesses and sicknesses. I had made a post on Facebook um, yesterday saying that um, there is no money and power in health. And that we guys need to pay attention. You know, a lot of you guys are woke somewhat when it comes to food. You are aware that they put things, they pump things in in our foods, you know, in our, you know, meats and, and spraying down the, you know, the vegetables and fruits that's sitting out in the produce area in these stores. And, and you know, you will say something about, like, they, pump, they pumping antibiotics in the meats and they're doing all this, but yet you're still buying it. You know what I mean? Yet you are still buying it. Um, and it has to stop. You know, we, you know, like I said, everything connects. Everything that's corrupt in this world connects somehow. Doctors, um, hospitals, you know, everything started up from these rich families. They want, that's why they're trillionaires. That's why you got one family that, that that's worth more than the entire world. Because they've been stealing from us from day one. Like even our foods, God created our foods for, for us to to grow them. We're supposed to be eating healthy foods. We read the book of Daniel. Um, when, I mean, with with the with the three guys, uh, Daniel, three friends, um, uh, Meshach, Shadrach, and Abednego. Um, you know, when they when the king and them was trying to feed them meats, and they chose not to eat meats. They said they would rather just eat, feed them fruits and vegetables and watch that they would have better that they would have better health than them. Their skin would be better. Um, you know, and they, it's the truth. God created us to eat healthy foods. Um, but of course, like I said yesterday with the, with the, uh, stimulus checks, what God meant for us to have that, you know, he created this world for us to have for free, you know, to grow our own foods and stuff. But what happened? You have people, these rich families that, that manipulated and tainted everything and made it so we have to pay for everything. So what do they do? They make the foods that are bad for us cheap and the foods that we need to eat expensive, making it hard for us to buy it and so and and to make it worse because they got to make the money they got to is is money in medicine is money in medicine and look and and um, and let me explain something to you about money in medicine take cancer for instance cancer treatment probably can cost say for instance let me give you an uh, example on how they're making money off cancer that's why they not rushing to, to, to um cure you from it that's why they're Tell you how you how these people thinking, oh, I got cured, I've been free to cancer. Some of them do be, you know, cured. But then later on it come back. You know what I mean? And so, um, what they do with cancer, say for instance that you, you say for instance cancer treatment costs uh three thousand dollars. Say for instance that's the price of it. Well the the hospital the doctor is gonna charge you probably about nine thousand dollars. You know what I mean? And the insurance, um, and the insurance to cover the three thousand, <laughs> and then they keep, and and the, the, and the insurance will probably cover like the whole nine thousand. Say for instance, it does that, or at least eighty percent of it. The three thousand are going to go to the um, treatment, and then the doctor going to keep the rest. You know what I mean? So that's that's basically a little um, idea on how. They, they get paid off cancer. Cancer is a money maker. And so is COVID. COVID is about the same. If you, The amount of deaths that they get in COVID, that's the money they're going to get. That's why they're faking. They're doing these fake COVID tests. But I'm not getting into that. We're going to talk about the foods. Why do you think they pump antibiotics or pump all these different things and spraying these fruit, um, fruits and stuff with pesticides? Why do you think they're doing that? Because these are the type of carcinogens that get in your body that can cause cancer. If you get cancer, you go to the hospital. They get the, you go to the hospital, you go to all these little doctor's appointments, you got all these treatments, the doctors get paid. So we have millions of people that are sick of cancer, and you see the money that's flowing in? So and how would they expect us, you know, to make, get them that money in them hospitals if they don't taint the foods? Our foods are meant to be grown. That's why we have to change the way we eat. We have got to stop helping them kill us. We got to stop helping them kill us. You know, the devil, what did the devil do? The devil does things, he does things to pleasure our flesh, to give us um, pleasures to our flesh. 
when we smoke get high and trust this is coming from somebody who used to smoke and get high off some weed now i ain't do nothing else but i smoke cigarettes i used to get high i used to get drunk i was more high than drunk <laughs> but they created these, they made these things available to us so we can kill ourselves. But at the same time, it became addictive. That's why they did it. They put in these addictive um, ingredients so you can keep wanting more. You keep wanting more alcohol. Alcohol going to lead to either cancer or cirrhosis to the liver. Then you back at the hospital and then the doctor's getting paid. This is like a hand over fist for them. But we're not paying attention. Because we're too busy loving what we're doing. That's how we're doing with the foods. You're eating all these unhealthy foods, and then they and they um, pumping them up with stuff. We don't care. We're trying to eat good. We're having cookouts. Got slabs of steak all on the grill and all that stuff, and they're killing us with it. But if everybody got together and stopped eating meats and stopped eating um and eat um vegetables or work on growing your own or start heading to these farmer, farmer's markets... And if you can't make it, um, grow your own, make it a farmer's market, you start trying to just find foods, you know, vegetables and, and um, fruit and pray over your food. But don't eat the foods that you know are killing you. You know what I mean? These meats and all these other things are killing us. These processed foods are killing us. Why? Because they can put whatever they want in it. And then when we come hip to it, then they start sending stuff like these are uh, free range. This is free range chicken or um, this is uh, no antibiotics, no hormones. In it. And it probably still has it in it. It's just that when you get the ones with no hormones, they increase the price, more money, and they're still poisoning us. This is the reason why they killed Dr. Sebi. Sebi, how do you probably pronounce his name? Because he knew that it was in the foods as well. And then he comes up with this plant-based food diet, which is a great um, diet. It's, just, it's basically you being vegan. Um, creating your own meats through things like chickpeas and stuff like that instead of using their meats. If you want sausage links, you use chickpeas. You want hamburgers, and you make hamburgers out of mushrooms or whatever. It's, it's great. Trust, we be crushing this stuff here. It's really good. Um, if, if you still want to still eat like that, if you want fries and you make, you make them out of, um, you know, chick um, peas or something else instead of the stuff that they're providing. But this, and this is, and that is what prevent people from getting cancer because they're not taking in the foods that is filled with the carcinogens, all the ingredients that leads to cancer. This is the reason why they killed him. They were stopping his money. He had done cured like, like 71 different people and celebrities at that from cancer he was in the way that is millions of dollars he is taking from people so they had to dismiss him and they did the same thing to um nipsey hustle why because nipsey hustle planned on carrying on that documentary that thing with dr sebi so everybody can get out get those um foods and different type of stuff that we're supposed to eat out so they had to get him out the way this is why you guys got to pay attention you can't mess with their money and we got to stick together and and work together to mess with their money we have got to take their money from them and stop buying those things that are killing us because we are not we're doing nothing but helping the enemy um we have got to open our eyes and wake up and not help them kill us everybody need to change the way they eat because you know like like with with, with, with sweets and what is in the, what is in cakes and stuff they put these things in there to make us addicted to sweets and what happened when you become addicted to sweets diabetes Diabetes leads to insulin. That's money. You remember, insulin was extremely high. They was making money off insulin. They was charging these cats like three hundred something dollars a month for their insulin, close to four hundred dollars a month. I mean, it was just very depends on the type of insulin that was used. And then Trump comes in and he works hard to lower the price of insulin almost eighty to ninety percent, where people could afford the insulin. I mean, that, I mean that's that was the least he was he was you know he could do. You know what I mean? But what happened when Biden got in office? <laughs> he increased the insulin back up to where it was. These people do not care about your health. And we sitting up here, because I was, I was guilty of it too, acting like Democrats to bomb. Democrats are evil. They are evil. All they're doing is exactly what, um, what God said. They're stealing from the poor. They're they, they manipulating the poor.
That's why they made the, the, the unhealthy foods cheap, because they know that that's all we can afford. Well, I don't I don't buy that crap. So that's all they that's all they can afford. You know what I mean? Then they give them the food stamps and make it easier for them to just see. This is the this is the control. This is this is part of control. I said power and control. You own power and money. As long as they got the power and the money, they they rule the world, and that's what they're trying to do. They rule the world. They and you guys are not opening your eyes to it. Pay attention. Understand what they are doing to us. Change your eating habits. Stop letting them kill us. I, I pray. Ask God to deliver you from these cigarettes. Deliver you from these drinking alcohol all the time. I know it's pleasurable and I know it's fun. But but you're going to enjoy that fun and play around. And then the devil going to betray you like he always do because he always pleasure us. He gives us these pleasures that's temporary. It has a temporary feeling. That's why crack crack has a slow high. I mean a quick high because you got to go back and get more. That's how they did it. They set it up that way. So you can keep going back for it. And then later on, when you, when you got some type of disease, some cancer, cirrhosis of the liver, high blood pressure, whatever, then they have won. And then you're going to be complaining and asking God to help you, get you out of the situation, what you need to do now, while you of good health, is ask God to help you in this. Pray for this. And start changing your, the food. Stop letting them kill you. Stop eating what they are providing. Cut, leave the meats alone, leave all that junk alone, leave all them processed foods alone, because then you're going to take away their money. And I'm not, this ain't a black thing, this is a everybody thing. Start taking your life back, start getting your money back, take it back from them, and stop letting them break us.